Ever wondered why being um, being single as a Christian sometimes feels like walking a tightrope? It's a challenging path, laden with societal pressures and the struggle to maintain purity. It's tough too, searching for a partner who shares your faith and values, but don't lose heart. This is a time for faith, for patience, for self-love. It's a time to grow, to discover who you are in Christ. Remember, being single is not a curse, but a season of growth and self-discovery. So how do you navigate the singlehood journey as a Christian? Well, let's start with personal growth. This is a perfect time to explore new hobbies, learn new skills, and work on self-improvement. These experiences will not only make you a more rounded individual, but they can also help you to become a better partner in the future. Deepening your relationship with God is also crucial. Spend time in prayer, study the Bible, and seek God's guidance in your daily life. This will give you strength and wisdom as you navigate through your singlehood journey. Seek out a supportive community. Surround yourself with people who uplift you and share your faith. These relationships can provide comfort, guidance, and accountability. Remember, there's no need to rush into a relationship. Cherish this time of independence and use it to serve God and others more freely. In the end, it's not about finding the right person, but becoming the right person. So what's the takeaway from all this? We've explored the ups and downs of being single and Christian, offering practical strategies to help you navigate these unique challenges. We've stressed the importance of personal growth and patience, reminding you that this is a season to be cherished, not rushed. To sum up, singlehood isn't about ticking off boxes or racing to the finish line. Remember, your singlehood is a journey, not a race. Embrace it with faith and patience, for in due time, everything falls into place.